new jersey has not sent a republican to the senate since one nine hundred seventy two but it might this year despite the unpopularity of president bush and the war in iraq in towns across new jersey like here in summit voters have been wrestling with a close race between a candidate who was an early opponent of the iraq war and one whose name is practically state political royalty sensing their only chance to take a senate seat away from the democrats national republicans are channeling money into the campaign of tom kane jr the namesake of the revered former governor who chaired the 9-11 commission kane has hammered relentlessly on the theme of corruption insisting robert menendez appointed last year by governor john corzine to fill corzine's unexpired senate term is under an ethical cloud it's you the taxpayer duty being asked to pay more at every level of government because these deals are going on we need to root out corruption at every level of government. It's one of the reasons I'm running for the United States Senate. Well, no, I won't, I won't admit that it's dirty, nasty New Jersey politics. I will admit that it's dirty, nasty Tom Kane Jr. politics. Menendez, who as congressman voted against the war in Iraq four years ago, has taken every opportunity to tie Kane to the president and the war. And even though the events of the last two years have largely discredited George Bush's position on Iraq, Tom Kane Jr. still stands with him. I've clearly said that there have been horrendous mistakes made by this administration in the war in Iraq. And I've called for Secretary Rumsfeld's resignation. Pre-election polls in the state give Menendez a slight lead, but the race is one of a handful of Senate contests labeled too close to call. Well, I'm going to vote for Mr. Kane okay. uh, because of all the publicity that Menendez has gotten, poor publicity. The, the, the corruption stuff, yes. the investigation stuff? Yeah, yeah, that's really turned me off from him. I think I'm going to vote Democratic. Uh -huh. And that's because? Uh, I actually heard Menendez um, speaking on the radio yesterday, and I didn't disagree with anything that he said. And then there's the wild card, gay marriage. The New Jersey Supreme Court ruled recently that the state discriminates against same-sex couples by not allowing them to marry. It's unclear whether the issue could energize dispirited social conservatives who usually vote Republican. Warren Levinson, The Associated Press, Summit, New Jersey.